What's up everybody, it's your boy Corey, aka GQ Saint, back from the reaction video. No, I haven't posted that much this past week. No, the most recent video I did was my official review of the Saints, the new Saints Row game. Which you haven't checked out, go ahead and check it out. Either way, meant to post more this week, but once again, had a, to those you don't know, had a relative, my close, close relative, I was still close with to this day, passed away. And we had a funeral this past Wednesday, and take Saturday for me, so... These past few days, I'm still processing, checking in with my grandmother, because my grandmother's sister, on who's basically been another mother figure, and basically was a diamond to everybody in the family. So, yeah, it was pretty sad, but we all slowly processing, everybody getting better. So that's why I say, you know, I'll take a few days off. Anyway, back in the reaction video, they just found a death battle, fish come back, official early analysis. This basically lead up, this is basically a fight between James Bond versus John Wick. I don't know what I'm going for. I like both of them. Keanu Reeves, David John Wick character, great. Daniel Craig, I actually like his character, James Bond, especially I saw the most recent one. That was a good movie. Sad about the ending, though, but yeah, it was a good movie. And good Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig, he's a, he's a great actor, so is Keanu Reeves. And they coming out with another John Wick 4. I did, I think I did, did I did a video of that. Yeah, one of my favorite martial arts going to be a movie, which is down the end. They appreciate it's going to be the villain. So anyway, don't talk about John Wick in this one. This is all about James Bond, baby, 007. So I'm trying to see, are they going to use the, which James Bond are going to use? I wonder. Hmm. Okay, you know, they're a different version. So I'm trying to see which version they're going to use. So anyway, let's go and dive on in. You already know, express your question. You have a comment below. Let me know what you're at to. Let's get it. From the shores of Crab Key to the craps tables of Casino Royale. From Russia with love to Moonraker at the edge of outer space. No man has saved the world more times than Bond. James yeah. Bond. He's the OG action hero. The slickest scum. Fun fan, my barber. He always talk about James. The main reason little James Bond. Like the way he slide is also the different women. Beautiful women that be appearing in the movie. So yeah. That's one point out there. there ever was the coldest warrior of the swinging 60s. After a climbing accident in the French Alps took his parents, the young James studied abroad and graduated to the Ministry of Defense, just in time for World War II. He rose through the ranks, quickly becoming a commander of the Royal Navy. And when you find the thing you're good at, in his case, wanting murder, never do it for free. So after the war, James decided on Her Majesty's Secret Service and became a special agent of MI6. And they were so impressed, he was given his first two state-sanctioned assassinations. With this mm -hmm. baptism in blood, I love Bond that. was granted the legendary 00 status and a well, license just... to kill with <laughs> impunity. As the premier defender of the West, Agent 007 is a jack of all trades when it comes to kicking commie ass and terrorist ass. And basically everyone's ass for the past 60 years. Yeah. From the novels to the movies to the comics and games, he's been rebooted tons of times. Oh, yeah. But they're all still Bond. I just want to point out, GoldenEye, definitely one of my favorite Nintendo 64 games. Me, my friends, my whole family, we, we love that game, GoldenEye. I think that was one of the earliest Nintendo game, Nintendo 64 disguise, games I played. Driving, diving, I've got old I was. Boating, I was young. Climbing, horseback riding. <sighs> Airplane pilot, swordsman, knife fighter, knife thrower, people thrower. And deadliest of all, gamer. Bond carries his classic Walter PPK, among the world's first successful double action semi automatic pistols. While it only carries nine rounds, its small size makes it optimal for concealment. And a microdermal sensor in the grip coated to Bond's fingerprint means only he can fire it. It even comes with unique That's ammo dope. that breaks apart upon entry and creates eight exit wounds, mm. traveling like a bullet but hitting like a shotgun. Especially deadly yeah, that's, considering that's, Bond that's has deadly. the golden eye of an expert marksman, able to take out a room of armed guards in a single second or shoot the fuel tank of a helicopter from a speeding boat a quarter of a mile away. He's just mm. as deadly disarmed. Bond combines multiple martial arts like judo, <laughs> boxing, Krav Maga, Muay Thai, and Jiu Jitsu, allowing him to keep up even when outnumbered. This mix of styles is likely the Welsh self-defense system known as Gushinkwai, which is taught by the modern mm. special air service. Though that all pales in comparison up. to his greatest ability. Bang. Bang it. <laughs> Lay it down, pipe. He's so Yeah, well, I'm talking about, man. That's what I'm talking about. Feels more like a superpower. Look, we're not kidding. He once seduced a female assassin sent to kill him so thoroughly, she threw herself in front of the bullet meant for him. 
she knew him for less than two minutes. It's a tale mm. as old as time, Wiz. Boy James Bond to me. James Bond to me. Between her superhumanly strong thighs, girl's spine gets snapped in half by a helicopter, punchline, fairy tale ending. Okay, then, reeling this whole conversation back a bit, come back in a few days as we cover Bond's opponent, John the Wick, legendary stay tuned. hitman, John Wick. Boy meets... I don't know. This would be a very, very good fight. I'm going, I ain't picking no side. I'm being neutral. Okay, that was a pretty cool video. Yeah, so that funny part was how James Bond, girls, girls, girls. I'm talking about James Bond, the official playboy. So, yeah. So, I don't know, man. John Wick, he's pretty good. So, I, I'm not, like I said, I'm not picking a side on this. I'm going to kick back and enjoy the fight because I like both of them. Anyway, John, well, he's definitely, I would say he's a little bit more darker than James Bond. But either way, this should be a very good fight. Anyway, you about to, today's Saturday for me, so I will drop both of these videos, say, so stay tuned. So once I get done with this one, move on to John Wick. Anyway, make sure you give a boy a like, comment, and subscribe. Once, once again, have a great day. Well, to me, it's Saturday, so have a great weekend. Peace.